I'd like to tell you a story. Well, it's one of my favorite stories because it's got a girl in it that I know well. Her name is Claire. And when Claire was a little girl, she loved animals. She still loves animals, but she loved to go and stay at her nanny's house. Now, whenever you're going to stay overnight, you know what you have to do. You have to pack a bag. Can you think of things you need to put in? Can you think of them? Well, of course, there'd be pyjamas, vest, pants, socks, shoes, um, T-shirt, jeans. Help me if, if I'm not saying the right thing. Uh, maybe a swimming costume, maybe boots if it was going to be cold. Teddy, Teddy would have to go. A good book, mm, she'd probably take. The Three Billy Goats Gruff and a present for her nanny. I don't know what you think Nanny would like. Our Nanny loved flowers. So when Claire went to her Nanny's house, she used to run into the bedroom. You'd hear her feet go. She'd run, she'd hop into bed. Nanny would pull up the covers and give her a big kiss. Flick off the light and close the squeaky door. And Claire sometimes would go. So Nanny would say, what's wrong, Claire? She said, I'm lonely in here. Right, said Nanny, tomorrow night, take the dog in. So the next night, she ran in the bedroom, hopped into bed. The dog hopped into bed. Granny pulled up the covers, gave her a big kiss, flicked off the light, closed the squeaky door. <laughs> ruff, ruff, ruff. Nanny said, what's wrong now, Claire? She said, we're still lonely. Right, said Nanny, take the cat with you. So the next night she ran in the bedroom, hopped into bed, the dog hopped into bed, the cat hopped into bed, granny pulled up the covers, gave her a big kiss, flicked off the light, closed the squeaky door. <laughs> ruff, 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 meow. Nanny said, what is wrong now? She said, we're still lonely. Right. The pet lamb, the wee lamb I was feeding with the ball. All right, you can take that. So the next night, Claire ran in the bedroom, hopped into bed, the dog hopped into bed, the cat hopped into bed, the lamb hopped into bed, Granny pulled up the covers, gave her a kiss, flicked off the light, closed the squeaky door. <laughs> ruff, 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 meow, meow. Nanny said, what is wrong now, Claire? We're still lonely. Right, it's your last night. I've only one animal left. I don't know how this is going to work. You can take the horse to bed. So the next night, Claire ran in the bedroom, hopped into bed, dog hopped into bed, cat hopped into bed, lamb hopped into bed, horse hopped to bed. The bed went crash. The house went crash. And Nanny, because she's very clever, she went out and she bought a big strong house with a big strong floor and a big strong bed to hold Claire, the dog, the cat, the lamb. And most of all, do you see? That's the horse. And you can find that in a book called Boom Chicka Boom which you can borrow from the library. It's by me.